how we live affects how long we'll live and how healthy we'll be as we age. By most estimates, lifestyle accounts for about 70% of our longevity. Genes are responsible for the rest. Even the healthiest lifestyles and the best genes will only get you so far. <laughs> we'll take you to longevity hotspots around the globe to find the secrets they hold about long life. Dan Butner is also looking for centenarian hotspots, not in long-lived families, but in places on the globe where a disproportionate number of people live a very long time. He calls them blue zones, and he's found them in Sardinia, Okinawa, Loma Linda, California, and Costa Rica. And because most of longevity is dictated by our lifestyle as opposed to our genes, we believe that by going to these blue zones and methodically looking at what these people do, we can distill out a de facto formula for longevity. On the Nicoya Peninsula in Costa Rica, men who reach 60 are four times as likely to reach 100 as their counterparts in the United States or Europe. Families are close here. Hard work is the norm. And there's no such thing as retirement. This 80-year-old uh, has the vigor of a 40-year-old. These Costa Ricans also eat a healthy diet. Plenty of vegetables and fruits like papaya and citrus fruits. And the tortillas they eat are made using a special process that produces more calcium, helping to keep bones strong in old age. Panchita is a good example. She's 100 years old, walks where she needs to go, and is still able to wield a machete. In Sardinia, Butner says the local wine has special properties. It has the highest levels of polyphenols, these uh, artery scrubbing antioxidants of any other wine in the world. In Okinawa, Butner credits ikigai, or sense of purpose. And they know why they're on this planet. If their ikigai was a karate master, they continue to fuel that activity with the same passion. Okinawans also eat a low-fat diet rich in fish and fruits and vegetables and loaded with tofu. I know tofu is a strange food for a lot of people, but it's arguably uh, the world's most perfect food. High in protein, low in fat, it's full of uh, minerals, and it also contains something called phytoestrogen, which has been shown to uh, lower your chances of getting a heart attack. Uh, it's been shown to reduce your chance of breast cancer. In Loma Linda, Butner points to clean living and a stress-relieving Sabbath. What then shall we say, brothers? Loma Linda is the area of the highest concentration of seven-day Adventists, and they're conservative Christians, uh, Methodists, which means they're not drinking, they're not smoking, taking that 24 hours off every week to de-stress, get their exercise. Butner says the Blue Zones offer a recipe for healthy living that could add eight good years to your life. And he offers this advice. Eat a plant-based diet, mostly plants. Uh, number two, regular low-intensity exercise. And then number three, invest in family and friends.